The mental hygiene framework is built on the idea that it is an important aspect of general health. Health, holistic health, in other words, to feel whole, is multidimensional and requires the presence of many factors. In this sense, although mental hygiene is important for one's mental well-being, it is not the whole answer and likely not sufficient on its own. Holistic and flourishing health requires a multitude of good habits. The habits that we form in our day-to-day -day lives are in large part the drivers of our health outcomes. For example, it is hard to feel optimally well when every day we walk into our bedroom in the evening and find clothes lying all over the place and our sheets and our covers bunched up all together, crinkled in the bed. Good habits like tidying our room, regularly putting our clothes away, making our bed every morning are significant contributors to good health. The same is true for many other dimensions of health. Ensuring we get good sleep hygiene by avoiding nicotine, alcohol, and caffeine in the evening and getting our about seven or eight hours of sleep every night is paramount to good health. Brushing our teeth twice a day, showering daily are obviously of great value. Eating three balanced meals and minimizing excessive processed foods as well as getting plenty of water is also important to consider. Targeting 150 minutes a week of moderate physical activity has numerous benefits, as everyone knows. But also of great importance is what we may call social hygiene. That is, having a good habits around regularly connecting with family and friends. There is a lot of research that has highlighted the absolute vital importance of regular human connection for good health. Making that phone call to reach out to a friend or family member you haven't spoken to in a while. Taking the time with our partner to put the screens away and just chat. Good social connections is not something that just happens, but is also in large part a product of good habits. As we can see, flourishing health requires a multitude of good habits. It doesn't mean we have to worry when we don't get it exactly right. Life is a long journey and we humans are all in this together just trying to figure it out. But we want to have a good map to guide us in the right direction. Mental hygiene too is a key piece in the overall picture where we learn to integrate the habit of exercising our minds to minimize rumination, nurture positivity and psychological resilience, as well as cultivate self-awareness. So mental hygiene is an excellent daily habit to adopt, but certainly not the only one.